Hello and welcome to another video from Olympus. My name is Lewis and in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can use the LSP4 audio recorder as a USB plug-in microphone for your computer. The LS range of recorders are a very versatile audio recorder that can be used for anything from speech to music, from ambient sounds to even sound effects. But you can use them as well for recording the audio on your video, whether it be plugged into the camera directly using the hot shoe mount or whether it be placed closer to the subject to eliminate any background noise for you to then sync in video editing afterwards. But did you know the LS recorders have a hidden feature? And that is that you can plug them directly into the computer as a USB microphone to improve the audio quality of your Zoom conference calls, maybe your Skype calls, or whether it be paired with the OMD web app to get high quality audio to match the high quality video. But before you go anywhere near a USB port, it's worth looking in the menus to just double check that the LS is actually ready to go. Let's take a quick look. So after turning it on, making sure that the audio recorder is in stop mode and not flashing and recording anything, press the menu button once and scroll all the way down using the plus and minus button to device menu which is down at the bottom. Then press OK to move the cursor into the list of setting items. Then use the up and down again to select the USB settings. Press the OK button and then go to USB class and select composite. This will set the recorder to USB audio class and the recorder will be recognised as a USB microphone or speaker on the computer. You can then select the recorder in your video software. Alternatively, you can use the LS to record directly into the computer using audio editing programs such as Audacity. On a Mac, this is nice and easy. All you have to do is press the Apple logo at the very top left of the screen, go to System Preferences, and here you will see the sound icon. If you click that, you will then see Audio Control DVR when you're in the Input tab at the top. Then just adjust the input volume up and down to make it sure that the audio levels are just as you need them. On Windows, go to the Start menu, hit the Settings cog. Then you want to go into System at the top left and then Sound on the left sidebar. Then you can choose your input device, mine has automatically selected it. And then Device Properties will allow you to change the levels again. So then if you go to Levels at the very top tab, and then you can adjust the microphone levels just to make it louder or quieter. And as you're talking, you can see the test microphone just underneath to give you some idea of just how loud it's going to be. If it doesn't appear to be working on your Zoom conference call, just go to the microphone symbol at the very bottom left where there's a little arrow, click that one. And then you can select microphone and make sure that microphone audio DVR is selected just there. You can also attach separate microphones to the LSP4, whether it be the shotgun boom mic for added directional control, or whether it be a lapel mic to get closer to the speech. But if you are going to use this as a standalone microphone, it is worth putting it on a mini tabletop tripod just to remove any table vibrations that you may get. So there you go then, thank you for watching. If you haven't got an LSP4, now may be the time to buy one, but if you have now, you've got an additional feature that you can use. I hope this has been helpful. Thank you for watching, stay safe, and I will see you on the next one.